Hey YouTube, how's it going? If you're new here, then my name is Kegu Sano. I make YouTube videos about Flutter and software development in general. So what I have is I have a MacBook Air 2017 which has about 120 GB of storage. So I thought to upgrade my storage with this one, Samsung 970 EO Plus of 500 GB of M.2 drive. So I want to show you the differences that I get after upgrading my storage. So let's begin. So we are doing a standard Blackmagic disk test. Here we can see that uh, our write speed is about 680, right? 680 megabyte per second, and read is about 12, 1269. So I'm going to show you the Flutter version that I'm using right now. That is 2.2.3. So I'm going to go to my uh, external drive. I'm going to load up my project that I've been working on. I'm going to do a run on that project. So as you can see here, I am running the main production over here. So the main waiting time, what I see is uh, like waiting for connection to service of Chrome. I don't know why it's taking that much time. Here we can see it took 36.0 second on external drive, not on the storage of the MacBook itself, but on the external drive. So the complete time was like 1.6 minute till I see that, see this black screen. So let's uh, try something else uh, let's move the project into the macbook storage itself not on the external drive here i'm running a copy command so uh, unexpectedly this copy took around one minute i thought the i think the file is quite big so i'm going to go to the desktop and run the project once again from my internal storage as you can see here i'm running the same command it did the flutter pop get i don't know why it did but it only took one one thousand millisecond that that's not much right and the service to chrome, uh, chrome connection is like 43 and total is 1.8 minutes so now i think we have tested everything let's upgrade i have upgraded the storage now the current speed is like 1271 which is like twice as fast as previously it was and read is like 1438. I'm quite happy with the write, but not so happy with the read. So I'm going to go to my documents. This is the internal storage itself. I'm not working on external drive now. I did the Flutter run once again. Uh, we are still waiting for the Chrome. And it did improve. It was only 57.1 second, uh, seconds. Yeah. So here the project is loaded. So what we're gonna do now is, I'm gonna quit. I'm gonna create a project, right? Let's see how fast it is, right? Let's create a sample project, uh, which was only 4.9 seconds. It was quite good, I think. And I'm gonna do a flutter run on that project once again. So it was only 47 seconds. As you can see, if you are using a MacBook Air 2017 and you can test it out and come see the differences before upgrading. I'm going to show the storage, current storage status. It's like I have still 435 GB of storage available. So overall, I'm really happy with the uh, storage improvement and the write speed. Uh, basically, what I used to do was, uh, since the MacBook Air 2017 came, only came with 128 GB of hard drive, I usually move all my heavy stuff onto the external drive. Uh, that made me dependent on external drive for a very long time. So if you want to upgrade, then I don't think you have to buy the 970 EO Plus because this actual performance of the 970 Plus is much faster or much bigger than the what, what we see in the Black Magic itself. So you can go with the uh, lower end of external drive and go for higher storage. You can go for one TB or something, which doesn't, I think MacBook itself is not able to, not able to get full performance out of uh, high speed drive such as this you can go with the crucial and stuff okay uh, that has been a short video i hope you like it uh, if you have any question then please leave a comment down below and consider subscribing to my channel that's it thank you so much for watching see you guys next time